Hi everyone, welcome to victoriapiping.com and today I'm going to make for you those Belgian waffles. We love those especially on Sunday mornings. Ariel love them with bacon and natural maple syrup and I love them with the salmon caviar. So I hope you enjoy the idea and stay tuned. Take a cup and a half of milk. I'm using goat's milk and it's uh, like because we love it you have to, you can use regular milk as well so this is cup and a half take fourth cup of extra virgin coconut oil i'm using this one or butter and place it inside cold milk like so. Microwave it or uh, just warm it until all the butter is all the butter or uh, coconut oil is melted and uh, the milk is a uh, very nice warm temperature when you can stick your finger inside and it will be very very nice. Take two cups of all-purpose flour Take four teaspoons of baking powder, add in. Okay, you can use uh, two tablespoons of sugar add. I'm not adding sugar, I'm adding maple syrup a little later. Add milk and the coconut oil inside. Mix it together. Now add your eggs inside as well. Add about two tablespoons of uh, maple syrup, but please, please, please use natural maple syrup because if you're not using natural maple syrup you're actually using high fructose corn syrup and trust me I'm all against this one maple syrup is the way to go add pinch of salt it's very important and mix all together By the way, if you are using organic ingredients, the color of the waffles is going to be a little bit more yellowish and more beautiful. But if you are using not organic ingredients, including eggs and etc., it will be pretty pale. Try not to over mix those, otherwise they are not going to be as fluffy as you want them to be maker to high heat. I'm using George Foreman one uh, with attachment of a waffle maker and add you see until it started to smoke and add knob of coconut oil or butter on top of uh, one. Take brush and just cover all of the surface with oil and this surface don't forget the upper surface, don't forget to brush it as well with the oil. Light coat of oil. Take large ice, ice scoop and add the butter on top. After about four minutes they are done and I'm making pretty small ones if you want them large and beautiful uh, place two ice cream spoons on each half those are luscious do the same to all the rest of the butter 
and make beautiful, beautiful waffles. What my son loves with uh, the Belgian waffle is um, bacon. So I'm making him bacon. And as you see, this bacon is organically grown uh, local pork. And it's a little bit more meaty, but anyhow, it's really, really, really good. I'm adding a little bit, tiny bit of water, as you see here, just to get it started and to reduce the amount of fat in the um, bacon. And afterwards it starts to crisp up. It will take a couple of minutes until all the uh, water will evaporate. Now it's uh, all the water is evaporated and it's almost cooked. So just crisp up it and that's it. And your um, bacon is absolutely done. The, the outcome of this butter is about 9 to 10 waffles. So this is how I like them and my son loves them this way bacon on top it's just must and maple syrup on the side but you can cover it with maple syrup and you remember use natural maple syrup thank you so i hope you enjoy the idea and it doesn't matter how you like them they are perfect 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 forget to subscribe write me a comment Thumbs up me and cheers, Victoria. Love you all. See you next time.